Sometimes your immune system isn't Amazon Prime. It doesn't deliver results in one to two days. At the tail end of successful recovery from autoimmunity or chronic inflammation, everyone wants to boost their immunity fast. But real immune healing, especially from chronic issues, isn't about getting your immune system to sprint. It's about getting it to recover from a marathon. Let me explain. Basically, your immune system is designed for short bursts. And getting an infection and resolving it within days is what it's designed to do. But you can experience fatigue for yourself when you've been sick with a cold or flu for a week or more. You know that your immune system is running out of steam at that point. But autoimmunity or chronic inflammation is like having your immune system turned on, full blast, sometimes for years. When the immune system works for months or years, it burns through nutrients like zinc, magnesium, amino acids. They all get used up. That's why, even after recovery from chronic inflammation or prolonged autoimmunity, we sometimes see key immune system lab values, like alkaline phosphatase, drop. It's not bad news. It's a sign of prolonged effort by your immune system. Your body's been training hard. Healing takes pacing fuel and rest between efforts. Stay consistent, support those nutrients, and your immune system will grow stronger mile by mile. Your immune system isn't Amazon Prime. Low alkaline phosphatase isn't failure, it's fatigue. Healing isn't about speed, it's about endurance. Endurance brings lasting victory. Make sense?